friends welcome to today's video in this video I would like to show you two methods of JSON that are parse and stringify let me explain you what are these methods and how to use these methods basically parse method is used to retrieve or to access data from a web server and stringify method is used to send the JSON formatted text to the web server so this was this little introduction about these two methods now we'll see how we can use these methods in our scripting language called JavaScript so let's give some text here like convert string written into JSON format using parts and stringify so basically these are the two methods which we are going to use in our, in our scripting language let's give one p tag here this p tag this paragraph tag I am taking for to display the JSON formatted text so first we need to create one script tag under this script we are going to write some text here like we can take the name property take name as Musa put separator comma take another property called email and take xyz at the rate gmail.com put separator and take another property called contact one two three four five six so this is the string written JSON object this we need to parse using JSON parse text let's take another variable called parse text here in this variable I would like to parse the above JSON using this statement we can parse the text variable string written text variable in JSON because this is in the form of string so we need to parse first after that we can display using DOM now I am calling DOM its document object model document dot get element by tag name I would like to give ID here because we have taken p tag and the id is given as demo so call this id inside this single quotations dot inner html equals to parse text dot you can call any property here of the parse text you can call name or you could call email or you could call your contact so I would like to call name here give semicolon save this in the editor let's hop to the browser hit refresh you can see here we are getting the JSON formatted string on our HTML page now let's give email here save we can see that the email is working so this is about the parse method hope you understand about the parse method where we can use it is used to retrieve or access data from a web server now we'll show something more interesting that is stringify method of JSON so for that I would like to create 
one JavaScript object inside this object I would like to give title as mathematics put separator here and addition sixth after the title give year also 2017 let's say 2017 2017 put separator here and put semicolon here now I would like to stringify this stringify text json dot stringify inside this stringify I would like to give parameter as books now I would like to display this books variable JavaScript object sorry it was it is a JavaScript object so this JavaScript object I have to convert in a JSON format and I am doing this using stringify method and now I would like to show how we can show the stringify text on our page put here you might be wondering why I have given plus here to append this stringify text because in that demo paragraph parse text is already there so if we want to display this stringify text we need to append this one so it gets appended let's save this let's see in the browser save you can see here all the properties of JavaScript is showing title mathematics year 2017 and edition 6 so it is in same line you can separate this in another line by adding or by appending break tag here you can see here now our parse and stringify methods are working fine so in this way you can parse your text and receive data from a web server in JSON and you can also you could also stringify you can also use stringify method in JSON using this way you can send and receive data from a web server using JSON format hope you understand about the JSON parser parse and stringify methods hope you like this video thanks for watching this video i'll show you in the next